Hey everyone, welcome back and happy Sunday. Today's video is gonna be slightly different from our others because we want to show you the completion of our diesel heater install and realized um, after receiving the last part in the mail yesterday that we did lose some footage um, of using it at the Overland East Expo where um, it was terrific at night. When it was cold, it kept us warm. So all we did now was simply move the, um, we rerouted the exhaust from one side of the camper to the other just to have it bent further away from us. So hopefully uh, you follow along and like, and thank you so much to all of our new subscribers. Um, we just are loving watching the channel grow. And even as we're making this video, the notifications are coming in. So we wanna thank you all so much. So please enjoy and remember to like, share, and subscribe. Thank you. This section of the video is me turning the diesel heater on for the very first time. And then you're gonna hear the diesel pump priming the entire system. Again, this happened uh, about two weeks ago. Oh, here you go. And there is the uh, diesel pump trying to do its thing. I don't see any uh, fuel leaking anywhere, so my little tank hose is working. All right, so we're back down here again. This is the muffler, what it looks like. That was the temporary location of the muffler and exhaust until we got the new uh, pipe in the mail. Here's what it looks like. So this black line that you see right here, that's your air intake for the machine. Uh, this one here, god damn it. Wow, yeah, that's really hot, I just burned my finger. Wow, look at this. That was, uh, where are you? Look at that, I just burned my finger. Anyway, it is hot. There is my muffler, comes down right here, and goes out right here. Let me do something, let me close this to see how loud it is. I mean, you don't hear the pump at all. You do hear the blower, and it's blowing hot air. Here is where I lost some of the uh, videos. Um, I was planning to place a uh, small video here of us using the heater nighttime at Overland East to keep the family nice and, and warm. Uh, the next clip is me expanding a, uh, a opening so I can fit the uh, new pipe through. All I did was, uh, I just basically made the hole, right? Focus. Anyway, I just made the hole a little bit bigger. That's all, as you can see. And that's where my exhaust pipe's gonna go. I'll come out and do a 90. why it took a little longer because I just wanted it probably too perfect and so uh, it's becoming a pain I promise you guys it's a lot easier you just don't have to be like me I just wanted it it's one of the things through here there you go I just wanted to look like a regular exhaust for a vehicle. That's how it comes out, right? So now, I'm gonna remove now the muffler, put it back here behind the license plate so you don't see the muffler. And then the other, the other half of the, that pipe is gonna come up right here, behind here, connect with this one and then that will be the new exhaust on the opposite side because 
This is how I ran it for Overland East because I had no choice, I didn't have a pipe. There's no issues. Um, I had two carbon monoxide uh, detectors inside, everything was fine. But now that the new pipe is here, I really wanted it far away from the uh, air intake, which is right there. You can hear you can hear the pump speeding up you can hear the fan is speeding up As you can see right here, the muffler is right behind the license plate. That noise, I'm sorry, is just the exhaust. I'm standing right next to it. The whole system is on right now. Then gets rerouted right here. Let me go on the other side. Right here. That's a bend. And then you can see the muffler right there goes through all the way to the other side all right everyone so here you have it this is the conclusion of our diesel heater video uh, we're just showing you here how we can add the fuel from the outside of the camper so we did try to salvage as much footage as possible we hope that you were able to uh, learn and enjoy from it so please remember to like, share, and subscribe, and we will see you in the next one. Thanks. Bye-bye.